Welcome to the Intuitive Messenger channel. They call me Mitchell, the birthday boy, and today is your intuitive message, your um, life lesson, your spiritual teaching, animal communication, sometimes numerology. For today, March the 14th, Pi Day, it is, we just passed that incredible moment where it was 3, 1, 4, 1, 5, 9, 2, 6, basically what Pi was, um, what Pi is. So we just passed that moment. Of course, when I was sitting here in meditation, I passed it. So it was kind of a cool moment. I felt very agitated. But anyway, today's your message for today, the 14th of March, as well as the 15th of March. Today's Saturday, tomorrow's Sunday. Today's my birthday. I am 49 today, which basically means I'm moving into my 50th year. And I'll be honest, I had a different message planned, or I have a list of messages that I was going to plan, but during my quiet time, Spirit said this to me. And, and I'll be honest with you, I learned this lesson a long time ago, um, which is why age does not bother me at all. Aches and pains, different story. I, I work on getting rid of those. But the message today is why fight what is probably the most natural and truthful thing, and that is that you are aging. You are growing old physically, you know, and one day you will leave this body behind. You know, and as and I had that message and I thought, you know, that's something that I, I've embraced and, and I've, I've never really been that afraid of death, even as a kid. Um, again, like I said earlier, aches and pains. I know I don't want to be in pain or be aching, so I take care of my body best I can to avoid that. But then during my quiet time, Spirit said, embrace, allow, and love. And I think that has to do with the aging process. Embrace it, allow it to happen, and love all that you can. So... I'm going to say avoid fighting against what is probably the most natural thing. And, you know, they say death and taxes. I mean, we are growing old. And it sounds like a message. But I tell you, on my birthday, I'm celebrating that I am 49, moving into my 50th year. You know, celebrate every day that you've had on this planet and all the experiences that you had. Because I think that's what we're here mainly for, is to experience all that we can. And when you don't embrace that moving forward, I think we're missing out on a lot of the experience of it. And I think the more you can embrace this, the less likely you're going to have to come back and repeat anything in another life. Just saying. Just my opinion. And by the way, today is also Einstein's birthday. Just saying. So let me pull some cards for you today because I got, I have no idea what Fabian's got planned for me today. All I know is, I think lunch at noon, dinner at six, and something at eight. That's all I know. And I have new shirts and new clothes that I have to wear. So um, here's the Norman for today. Oh, number seven has been popping up all over the place. So interesting though, because this is the snake card, and it's number seven, it's queen of uh, clubs, which is queen of wands. So this is very interesting, because that queen of wands is usually Jamie. So I wonder if she'll pop up in my life today. But today is a number seven day. It's 14, which is five, but also it's a 16 day and 16 to seven. So seven is popping up with that energy today, which I kind of like. But this snake can be about, you know, the slithering, sliming, be careful what's around you, deceitful kind of things. Terror to go along with it is wheel. This can be about lots of choices. This can be about just the normal everyday goings and goings and, and just the going around the wheel of fortune, the merry-go-round that goes around and all these choices, but you got to get off the wheel. got to get off the wheel. And the wheel is number 10, so that's kind of a cool uh, number as well. Tomorrow, the 15th, Sunday, is going to be 4, which is house. Um, the house, the home. Sometimes this can be the body, but it can be your property, your house your actual physical house. Tarot to go along with it is going to be another 10, 10 of coins. So we've got two 10s here happening uh, today and tomorrow, um, Saturday and Sunday, and then the house and the snake. So it's a very interesting couple of days. Uh, I kind of like it. I kind of like it. So tomorrow looks like beautiful celebration, lots of fun in and around the house. Uh, with that ten of coins, which is often a, a bountiful celebration in a home with the whole family there. And then the four is the house. So there's your message for today and tomorrow. Thank you for all the birthday wishes. I'm liking all of them. I'll say special thank you now to those of you who watch this. I truly appreciate it. Check out my website, intuitivemessenger.org. Got four spreads up for the month of March. No cosmic caffeine tomorrow night. We'll do it next week on the 22nd in the evening. And I say to you, namaste. Have an amazing day. Bye-bye.